Text being a model communicator, a woman crouching near a boy in a wheelchair points at the screen of an electronic device on his chair. A second woman speaks. Modelling is teaching through doing. It isn't about what the child is or isn't doing, it's about what we, the teachers, are doing. We need to show them over and over again how they should be communicating. The place to start is with one person modelling. You use the system to say something to the child. You point and speak out loud only the message you are pointing to. Let's have another look, breaking down the communication procedures. 1. Start from the beginning of the process. For example, by picking up the book and going to the menu page. This way, you are reinforcing the correct use of the system. 2. Familiarise yourself with the available messages. Knowing what messages are available and where to find them will speed up the process. A woman with a toddler in her lap turns the page of a book and points. 3. Point as you speak. Do not tap, just point. Repeat parts of the phrase as you go to reinforce the message. With two-person modelling, you and another person use the communication system to interact in the presence of the AAC user. For example, various family members using a communication book to interact. A boy in a wheelchair has a communication book. Another teenager taps some pictures on the screen. Um, what is there to drink? There's some milk and juice in the fridge. Text, order your copy from www.urala.com.au forward slash comtech.php. The Urala logo appears underneath.